I'm going to start off with her Christmas joy box or, you know, like her Christmas Eve box, but um, I decided instead of giving it to her Christmas Eve to just do it December 1st. That way she has the whole month to enjoy everything in it. Um, I just had or got this crate from Walmart. It was um, just like an unfinished crate that I painted red and then I just painted on this with stencil. So here's like a little overview and I'll just show you what I have inside. So I have these footy pajamas with little reindeer on them. They're in size 12 months, so I'm a little scared they're not gonna fit because she's already wearing 18 month. Um, so we'll see if this will fit her. Another reason why I wanna give it to her on the first. Um, so yeah, we'll see if this fits, but I got her this. And then there's this other little um, Christmas outfit that I got from Target. It says I'm on Santa's nice list with a little reindeer and it has glitter and it came with the matching pants. I got this last year on clearance. That's like a tip I would give um, is to get Christmas clothing at the end of the year when it goes on sale. You'll save so much money and you'll have it for next year. It's just the tricky part is just trying to guess what size they're gonna be in because I think this is also in 12. So yeah, have to get this on her right away. <laughs> and then I also have these little like buffalo plaid pants to go with. I figured I could mix and match that with the shirt. Um, it's kind of like a tradition in our house to wear the buffalo plaid or check or whatever the pattern is on Christmas Eve. So my husband and I also have matching pants so we can be a little matching family. <laughs> this is a shirt I got from the children's place a while ago. Uh, it's not my favorite, but it's still cute. It says, what Santa won't bring me, my grandma will. It was on clearance as well, so, so why not? <laughs> And the only other clothing things I have are just these random Christmas socks. They're red and like silver. And then these ones have these little penguins on them. So I think that's all the clothing items. This is quite a bit. Um, I would just say like one pair of PJs would be fine. But yeah, I went all out. <laughs> and I already did buy her a... Christmas day outfit too. It's like a um like a light green kind of like corduroy uh, sweater dress kind of thing. I don't know. <laughs> um, and then I like to include some books, at least one. So I have this little reindeer book. This is only like three dollars off of Amazon. And then I also have elf book this book is huge like here's comparison to my hand <laughs> just wanted some classic books and then i got this let me see i ordered the ist felt tree off of amazon um i thought it would be fun for her have her own little Christmas tree to decorate and hopefully that she would not mess with all the real tree as much which she actually hasn't been messing with it which kind of surprises me <laughs> it needs unwrinkled but this is what it looks like it's pretty big and then it came with a bunch of these felt stickers where, so she can just decorate it herself. And they included this little like, kind of like advent felt calendar too, which I didn't even realize came with it. So it's pretty cute. She has her own little way to count down until Christmas as well. You can hang it on the wall. 
And then the last thing in her Christmas joy box is this little advent calendar I already had from last year from Target. And it just has a little candy cane where you can count down the days and everything. So I'm really excited to see her reaction to this. Um, today's actually November 29th, so on what, like two more days, she'll be able to open this <laughs> and just get to have fun with it. I didn't really want to add too many toys since she's gonna get so many for Christmas, but you can add toys or um, like any winter clothing items I need, like hats or gloves. And then you could add like some treats, like hot cocoa and stuff. She can't really eat too many treats yet, so I didn't want to add much. <laughs> um, now I'm going to show you her stocking stuffers. Just some ideas for if you have kids close to her age, around one. So like I said, she can't eat that much treats right now, but I did want some sort of candy in there so I did cotton candy since you know it'll just melt in her mouth so this is fluffy stuff it's strawberry and blue rasp flavored and I think I did also get another treat let me just like dump this out oh yeah I got a Hershey's build a Santa chocolate bar so, a couple treats and then the other stuff. I got these wrist rattles from Target. They're so cute. So it's for Santa with the little milk bottle and then the cookie. And this is something that I would like, you know, more think a baby would use. But when we were at the store, she actually picked these out and she really liked them. So I thought they were really cute. She can have fun with those. And then I got this two pack of these silicone teethers. They're really pretty. Um, yeah, I don't know if I already said, but these are from Amazon. And I think it was like $14 or something like that. And the colors are called, this one's called Muted. Just like really pretty color. I don't know if the color's showing up right on here. And then this one is called Apricot. It's kind of like a tan. You can probably see the colors better like that. So I got her those because she still does have teeth coming in. And they're also just fun for her to play with and also very aesthetic. <laughs> I think there's two more things in her stocking. I want to try to like get a mix of stuff like between like treats, toys, and then a couple like more practical items. So I got her this Crayola whip soap for the bathtub. It just makes it scented and it's also like a body wash. I think it's, yeah, I don't know if I said it's cherry berry scented. She'll have fun with that because she loves bath time. And then <clears throat> I did get her a toothbrush. She does have teeth. It's Grabeese, Gr I guess is the brand. I got this from Amazon as well. And I like that it's a like dual sided bristles. So you can make sure you get all of, you know, all around their mouth. Oh, oh. Tells you about the different things here. Yeah, so this is <clears throat> everything in her stocking it's not too much but it's enough and that's pretty much all I could fit in there <clears throat> so the last thing I was just gonna show you were a couple things that I already bought her for Christmas um, some things I had already wrapped downstairs so I'm gonna show you pictures on my phone of things I already got her and then some more ideas so here is this really pretty boho rainbow rug. <clears throat> Sorry, 
that we got from Amazon. I think it was like $30. Um, super cute. It's not like the best quality. It's really thin, but it's just more for looks than actual use, I guess. And then I got this Happerly, Happerly <laughs> brand. It's a fidget pop in the color terracotta, also from Amazon. It's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. It's just one of those, you know, silicone pop toys. I thought it'd be fun for her to just play with and then it's silicone so she can also like teeth on it if she wants. I think this was only like six bucks or something. And then I also have this up here because it's too big to wrap. It's a leapfrog scoop and learn ice cream cart. <clears throat> and it comes with a bunch of, there's cones and different ice cream pieces that you can put together. And this is like magnetic. And she already comes in here and tries playing with it. <laughs> I'm probably gonna get one of those like Santa bags to put over it so I can put it downstairs under the tree. And then I have to wrap these ones. So that's everything that I have. And then I'm going to show you <clears throat> a couple other things that I already bought and I already wrapped because I couldn't wait. <laughs> so we got this, there's gonna be a glare because it's my, on my phone. It's a, they're called Macron vehicles. Macron, Macron, <laughs> whatever. Um, it's just like a car set with truck and it's really cute for her and it was $39.99 off of Amazon. They have different colors too. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm like getting over a cold. <laughs> and then I got this pounding toy. They have more primary colors too, but I try to go for the <laughs> more aesthetic ones, I guess. It just has balls that you can <clears throat> pound in here and they can go down the xylophone and you can actually take the xylophone out and play with it and it comes with the sticks. It's $23.99. I got these Leapfrog Learn and Groove Shaken Color Maracas. Play different songs and teach about instruments. And then this Leapfrog Let Her Go Round Spin and Learn. <clears throat> it's like one of those classic sit and spins but it also has, you know, can teach like letters and everything. And then there's a very big item we got her, um, Gather Arc Playset. It's a, basically like a giant rainbow that they can play on, crawl on. You can even like rock in like, like, I don't know. <laughs> there's a bunch of stuff they can do with it. But it's like one of those foamnasium things. <clears throat> Sorry, I kept keep clearing my throat. But yeah, it's $309. And this is actually a pre-order right now. And I think it's going to ship, um, I think I said around January 20th. So if you're interested, I would suggest uh, pre-ordering it now. Before they get ready to ship them. They have other colors too, but it's a pricey uh, gift, but definitely well worth it. And then we also got her these mushy stacking toy cups. She has some now that she loves that are more like primary colors. So got her these in the petal color. And then we also got, keep, that glare is probably so annoying, sorry. Two pack of these um, wearable blankets. She was in the zippered sleep sacks for a while, but, um, now that she's like walking and I wanted something where she could actually, you know, walk around and, well, she's not walking, but she's standing, but <laughs> you know what I mean? So something to keep her warm since you're not really supposed to use loose blankets still. So that's everything we got. And then <clears throat> I have another, um, just like a list of more Christmas ideas of kind of like the Montessori more wooden, look off of Amazon. I can show you if you're interested. So 
so there's some like wind puzzles, silicone rainbow stacker, more stackers, just like a wicker doll bed, cuddle and kind dolls are always cute, wooden baby carriage, love every toys are really good, Montessori toy. Uh, these are for her like toy kitchen, more wooden puzzles, a rainbow stacker, another pound peg toy, just a lot of wooden toys. I just like the Montessori type where she can just use her mind to play instead of light, a bunch of lights and sounds. This is like a little silicone rainbow beach set, some um, plates and spoons, clothing ideas, winter gear. Yeah, so there's lots of options if you're more kind of like Montessori, more stackers, some bibs, socks. She loves these. Um, they're not really like wooden, but like they're thicker than paper. Uh, flashcards on a ring. She already has one set, and so I put the other variations of it because she loves the ones she has already. Other paper flashcards she literally chewed through in like a day. <laughs> it's like a little busy board for the car. Yeah, so there are lots of options. Clothing, food items, toys, another wearable blanket, some cups. This is like a activity table. You could also do like sensory play in here. Little like Russian nesting dolls. Baby dolls that are like 11, 12 inches for their size. They're soft baby dolls. This is a balance bike. So yeah, there's a lot of uh, options for you guys if you are wondering what to get your toddler slash baby. Um, I think that's everything, so I really hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you next time. Bye!